what's up guys? I am Harigama. Welcome back to episode 2-0 of Pokemon Glaze and this like challenge in the last episode. We got to Glenwood Town. We got some more cool Pokemon and now our team has changed even more. And let's get a little tweak quick team recap as you can see all my pokemon are at least level 50 uh, let's go through it right away my jolting is level 51 of course you know spore time in the last episode thunderbolt signal beam and slash which is awesome next up is wakiki dragon they're three levels away from evolving into a good old dragonite you know uh dragon race surf thunderbolt and thunder wave yeah <laughs> and next up is lapis level 50 you knows body slam ice beam dive and surf for now I don't know. I'm not sure about that dive. But anyway, next up is Blunt Level 51. Knows Dragon Claw, Earthquake, Rock Climb, and Elite Blade. Next up is a new Pokemon to our team, Juwachi. Oops. Uh, he knows Thunderbolt, Cosmic Power, Aerial Ace, and Psychic. And now our newest member of the team that we got last episode from taking on the Dojo. Our Blaze again, Level 50. Oh, we forgot. Did we forget? We forgot to nickname it. Wow. He knows Earthquake Power, Super Power, Slash, and Blaze Kick. Blaze Kick. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I taught it Slash uh, between this episode and last episode when it was leveling up. But I just barely realized we didn't nickname it. Can it learn Fly? Nobody can learn Fly. <laughs> Nobody can learn Fly. Like, what? Totally. <laughs> anyway, let's go inside of here. And apparently, this is the fighting types. And actually, let's talk to this guy first. Welcome to the Do Not. Or welcome to the Fun Obstacle to the. I can't read. Welcome to the final obstacle to the Tuna League. Tyson trains with our fighting types. I don't need to tell you how to take care of them, right? Dang right, you don't. Because I am a Pokemon master. Pokemon master, go! Go! Pokemon, go! No, it's okay. <laughs> I just did 50 sets of push-ups. Winning a Pokemon battle ought to be a breeze. How, how does you getting stronger make your Pokemon stronger? I never got that. Anyway, he has one Pokemon... And it is a good lead. I'm probably just gonna use Psychic. What is super effective against a freaking Glade? Whoa, F flying types, I guess. <laughs> All right, that works too. But anyway, since I am still trying to, uh, I'm still trying to level up my Wakigi to evolve. So I'm gonna, I don't know why, I'm gonna take the experience share off of Blaze again and give the experience share to my good old Wakiki from the islands of Wakiki. So anyway, I think there's like three. Uh, I think there's why are these Pokemon only level 39? Am I gonna be 10 levels higher? What? Come on That is not right man. That is not right The guide said that these people were gonna be at least like level 48 to 50s. The ace is level 50 Well, that kind of Sucks. Yeah, all these Pokemon are not even level 40. That is kind of booty right there. <laughs> not gonna lie Prime rapes coming out Prime Ape, get out of here. Well, there's one level po there's one Pokemon that's level 40 right there. But anyway, hopefully we can take on this gym leader for this episode and hopefully try doing another little task, a little side task that I want to do in another episode. Let me move down the screen a little bit. Yeah, hopefully we can take care of this gym, which I, I don't think we'll have a problem. We can take care of this gym and then go and do a side task that I want to do now that our Pokemon are all level 50 pretty much. And uh, we can try getting another Pokemon there that can back up our Juachi or Blaziken. Spoiler alert for anybody who who knows what I'm talking about. But anyway, was it only... Oh, no, there's six gym trainers here. I like how uh, in uh, every level of this gym, there's like different machines that you work out on. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Well, I only have three Psychics left. And Aerial Ace still kills them all. Not bad at all. My champ, get Psychic the heck out of here. Bam! Ain't no, you ain't living a stab from a Jew. Dang right, you ain't. <laughs> ain't. What am I saying? What am I talking like that for? Get out of here. All right, anyway, oh, uh, intimidate. No, I'm gonna have to use a psychic now. Boom! Get out of here. Critical hit with for the win. Three Pokemon. Oh shoot! I only have one more psychic though. There's one. And who's up next? Hitmonchan. Let me go ahead and switch. Yeah, let's go into. Let's go into Blunt. Screw it. Hitmonchan. Let's see what Rock Climb would do. Rock Climb does not, uh, does not, Rock Climb doesn't confuse my opponents. I remember seeing that one episode earlier in this series. I don't know how he, that my Pokemon got confused, or my, the, my opponent got confused, but it was after I used Rock Smash, but I, I, I don't know. Now I have this weird idea that Rock Smash confused my opponents, but oh well. So anyway, let's go in. I did one last heal up, and now let's go and challenge the gym leader 
our last gym leader, our eighth gym leader of the Tunon League, of the Tunon region. And it is against Tyson, Mike Tyson. <laughs> you made it all the way here. Not bad at all. But I'm in a league all my own. I hope you're ready to face the toughest gym leader in Tunon because you're about to battle him. All right, here we go versus the eighth gym leader of this game versus Tyson with the fighting types. Mike Tyson right here, man. He has five Pokemon. First out is a Hitmonlee. Level 43. <laughs> so yeah, I guess I'm almost 10 levels higher once again. That kind of sucks. I'm sorry, guys. I, I don't know why. Why did the guides? Why did this guide wrong? It is. It said at least level 50s right here. Man, not cool whatsoever. Not cool whatsoever. But anyway, let's go. Let's let's not ju let's not let Juachi sweep the heck out of Tyson. Let's go ahead and get some Joel Dick action right here, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> and uh, oh, he has a lumbar. Whoa! No! 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 Get out of here! Don't even hurt. Don't even. Oh, we might get sweat. Oh, we might get sweat. That's it's not. Come on, you can live it. You can live it. You can live it. You can live it. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. He can live it. Two Jagnans is crunched against my Jolting, and he lives it. How about that? Oh man, that Scrappy could have swept us if we were five levels lower. <laughs> but anyway, let's go back out into my Juachi and aerial ace the heck out of this Gallade, which fly flying types are the only thing that are super effective against Gallades apparently. And this Pokemon is level 43 as well, so let's go ahead and aerial ace it and see what that can do. Almost okay, was but not exactly. He's gonna sword dance me, but it doesn't raise his speed, so I'm gonna be able to outspeed this Gallade in the next turn and get off a good old aerial ace. Bada bang! Sweet. <laughs> Alright, so so far my Joldic took a quite a bit of damage from the two Dragonan Scrafty right there. But oh well. Lucario. Uh does steel resist Wait, is Lucario half steel? We'll find out with the psychic. We'll find out. He is half steel. Alright, but he's just gonna use a swords dance, so I'm gonna be able to outspeed the next turn and okay oh or in 2KO this guy. Even with that freaking Barry, whatever the heck he has. Get out of here, Lucario. So he is half steel type, so I could have came in and got Blaziken some action today. Wakigi's only two levels before evolving. Oh, shoot! Here comes a Kong Keldir. This is his last Pokemon in his level. 50... 46. Okay, so this is his ace right here, level 46. Let's see if Juachi can take out this bulky freaking Kong Keldir. With one Psychic, and he does! Okay, oh. So, uh, that Scrafty was the only thing that gave me trouble, actually. <laughs> Because I let it set up two Dragon Dances. Because I forgot that he gets Shed Skin and Spore and all that stuff. I shouldn't have spored him. But anyway, we defeated easily the last gym leader of this game versus Tyson. I, I can't believe it. I was the greatest challenge the league had to offer. And you beat me without breaking a sweat. I didn't want to give you my badge. Dang right. Is it the six pack badge? <laughs> oh, it's the clobber badge. It's clobbering time. <laughs> it allows you to move the waterfall outside of battle. It also lets you gain entrance into the Tuna League. Not to mention, it makes you look damn awesome. Here, take this too as a gift from me. Got Team 01. I think that's Focus Punch or something like that. Which he never even tried using, so I don't know why he would do it. Yeah, it's Focus Punch and blah, blah, blah. Go to the Two Knot League. Head west out the town. And don't stop to, to, to get enough. Uh-uh. Come on. <laughs> I don't know what the song is, but it's Michael Jackson. Anyway, let's get out of here. And now we can make our way downtown to some place I wanted to go before. So I'm going to have to go ahead and... Uh, Get my flying slave again, my good old flying slave, and uh, fly on over to... Okay, so let me cross out something. I did this last episode. This is my to-do list in Pokemon Glazed. So uh, let me move Pelipus back up front. And this is one thing I wanted to get. Uh, let me see. Let me get out of here. And we have to go to Soul Hill Strait by surfing west of Sea Spray Town. We haven't been to Soul Hill Strait at all. By surfing west of Sea Spray Town. Alright, there we go. Alright, so let me go ahead and get... Let me go ahead and uh, switch my Pelipus out for my Blaze again. There we go. Alright, so now let's surf west of Sea Spray Town. Or go west of Sea Spray Town. Oh, I should probably stock up on... No, I don't need Pokeballs. We're just battling some people. Spoiler alert. Uh, we have Ju Juachi. Let me switch him Rakiki. I want him to evolve. Even if he's going to be 10 level or 5 levels higher than the rest of my team. I want him to evolve so we can have a fully evolved team. That would be awesome, right? That would be a great goal to evolve Wakiki by the end of this episode. But I don't think, that, I don't think that's going to happen. But we'll see. We'll see. 
we'll see how it goes, man. Uh, let's go ahead and use a Max Repro since all these Pokemon aren't even good to train with. Oh, free po free uh, item right here. Whoa, I just surfed over that. Oh, an elixir. Not bad at all, not bad at all. Alright, so let's go over here, and I don't know if I battle these guys or anything like that. Oh, there's not even anybody to battle. So there's one house over here if you surf below uh, Sea Spray Town. And, uh, oh, there's a rare candy. Oh, heck yes, I am gonna use that. Wait, let me see. Is he... What's his... He just barely evolved, so let me go ahead and... Let me use a rare candy on Waikiki. One level before evolving. How about that, man? One more level. Let's go! Oh, we, with that rare candy, we might be able to actually evolve the freaking Waikiki, man. So we're in Soul Heal's house. Let's go inside of here and... What's up, dog? What's up, dog? Oh, my name is so... <coughs> My name is Sir here. People don't usually come to visit me. Not many people know it, but I'm really for in a different league. Would you like to battle? Oh, I didn't want to battle him. I wanted to switch in. I wanted Joel Dick up front first. Oh, well. I get the feeling a wonderful time is about to start. I'm excited. All right, so this guy is another... He's another Elite Four member in another league. And he looks pretty... He's an ace trainer. He looks pretty sketchy, not gonna lie. He has six Pokemon. First up is Dragonite. What? <laughs> it's a level 50. This is why I trained up, man. This guy is scary, and I, we're taking him out. We're taking we're taking him on pretty early in the game. Not gonna lie, but we'll see how we can do against this guy. He is setting up an agility. Let's see if he has anything against my lapis, because I'm gonna be able to ice beam this guy. He's gonna safeguard. Okay. Uh, I don't think that will work too much, or maybe I can't spore him anymore. Actually, but let's see how much ice beam does with no defense up, and I okay it. There you go, Lapis. Four times super effective for the win. Bada bang, bada boom. <laughs> Alright, cool. So Lapis is gaining levels. Victini, Psychic, and... I think we can stay in. He's half Psychic, half Fire, so I'm gonna, I could just stay in and surf this guy to death. Because it's stabbing on all that. All this Pokemon are level 50 as well, so... He has Fire Blast. Is that regularly effective or not? It's regularly effective. And... Dang! He's... That Fire Blast didn't do jack squat from a Victini. God dang. There you go, Lapis. Bulky AF. But he's hitting all these Fire Blasts. If that was me, I wouldn't be hitting those Fire Blasts. I guarantee that. But anyway, let's go and surf this Victini out of here. Get out of here, man. Cool. Here comes a Lucario. Ooh, this could be a Blaziken time to shine right now. Let's see. Let's see. Let Blaze kick. Oh, let's, let's go to an Earthquake, actually. Oh, this is a bad idea. Lucario might sweep me now. If this earthquake doesn't 2 KO. Oh. Oh an okay. Oh, Blaziken's first attack in this game, and it is an OKO. And it was against another level 50. Lucario. He wasn't over level, he was on the exact same level as a, as an opponent. And he's still OKO'd. Dang, Blaziken is power. He's proving himself. He come out and just prove himself just like that. He's like, nope. This is my time to shine. Bop, bop. <laughs> he hit him with a bop, bop. Now watch him bop, bop. <laughs> nah, but anyway, here comes an Espeon. Dang, that, that just got me pumped up right there. Fired up, if no pun intended. That earthquake, okay. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. But anyway, here comes an Espeon. Let me go ahead and spore. Oh, I forgot that it's safeguard up. I might have screwed up right there. Wait, suck it. It's regularly effective. That wasn't a crit. Was that a crit? Was that a crit? Oh my gosh, that was not a crit. That was not a crit. Oh! Do I outspeed? I outspeed, okay. Woo! I, oh, if I didn't have Spore on Joldik, we would have, might have lost somebody today. Okay, so let's see. Let me. Uh, no, nah, I'm not even gonna. Nah, let's just signal beam for that a bit. And, uh, oh. Okay, okay. I'm going- he's, he might heal up, so let me go ahead and use a Hyper Potion. Not even a Moomin Moke, we need a Hyper Potion in this boy. Yep, told you. <laughs> Just like that. Let me go ahead and Spore now to- to- to save my- my HP on Joldig. I don't want to- I don't want to waste a turn healing up again. So let me go ahead and Spore him since I know I'm gonna outspeed and keep him asleep for the next two turns and kill off this Joldig. Let me go ahead and slash this guy, just for the heck of it. And there we go. Two more Pokemon to go. Next up is an Infernape. Uh, I think I could... I'm going to Lapis. Screw it, let's just go into Lapis right now. And surf this guy. Oh, he's faster than me. Oh, shoot, that's kind of scary. 
Look at look at Lapis's HP, man. Over 200 HP. That is power. If I do say so myself. Oh, of course I was burned. Screw it. Play school. Oh, I do have a full restore. Don't I? I have two full restores. Let me go in and use one right now for that of it. Oh, shoot. Ice beam. Oh, shoot. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, kill him. Oh, kill him. Oh, kill him. Bam. We kill him. <laughs> All right, cool. So Glyscore is out of here. Get OKO'd. And now we, we took on a trainer that had the exact same levels as us. And we didn't lose any Pokemon. That's how you know our team is pretty dang good. Not going to lie. Defeated Sohio. You got me beat. Your desire in a noble, in the noble way, your Pokemon battled for you. I even felt thrilled during our match. That was a very good battle. We got 2k for that. 2k. And what do we get for this? I want to give you a gift for defeating me. Please take it. Oh, you don't have it even for your party. Don't worry, I'll send it to your PC. And I got a Victini! Oh, shoot, Victini, man. Two fire types we got in the last two episodes. That is great. So I can cross that out of my to-do list. And god dang it with Teeny. That is amazing. Did I see PC? Yes, I did. Let's go ahead and see. Get out the dead box, Victini. Oh, it's level 20, though. Well, that kind of sucks. Look at that. Look at that. We have a lot of options now. I haven't got... Well, I haven't... I, it's, it's rare in a Nuzlocke for me to get that many Pokemon as backup. He knows Focus, Energy, Sacred Fire, Endure, and Headbutt. And... <laughs> I'll stick with Blaze again, because he okay He proved himself worthy. But anyway, anyway uh, we're in Soul Straight. We can actually try getting an encounter here if we wanted to. Don't Wait, I think I have a Super Repel on, though. Or a Max Repel. Yeah, there we go. And, ah. Uh, I'm not even going to try. Not even going to try. Oh, wait. Yeah, screw it. Forget trying to get another encounter. There's all, nothing but tentacles here and all that. But anyway, uh, I, there was a box in there, I just checked it, so uh, let me go ahead and get Pelipus out front so we can fly back to where we need to go. And actually, uh, we might need a Waterfall Slave as well. I don't want Lapis to win a Waterfall, that's kind of dope. <laughs> that's kind of BS right there. I, I, need to, I need to find a Move Deleter though. That's what I need. Oops. I need a Move Deleter. So I can like, so actually like actually delete some moves off of my Pokemon and teach some better moves for them because I know I can do that but anyway all right help us get out of here all right there we go all right let's keep on going so we got it ah man I hope hopefully we can we can withdraw somebody uh, hopefully we can use a box after we use waterfall because I don't want to I don't want to do this all right let's just teach clam for a water uh, yeah, this is decent waterfall. I want, I want to keep Blaziken on my team though. Yeah, we got, we got, we got by without Blaziken before, so I don't think he'll, I don't think he'll be a, he'll be a too big of a loss if we don't use him. But anyway, waterfall it is. We're gonna teach it to our good old Pearl. It's all about you, Pearl. Is he a? Oh, he knows water gun, whirlpool, clamp. The heck? Dang, Pearl could have been my dive slave too if we were thinking about that. But anyway, we got a Buizel on in a Waterfall Gorge, so we don't need to we don't need to do any encounters. So we use use Waterfall Pearl, and now we're up here. And oh shoot, another Buizel! Another Buizel. So now there's all these guys, and let's see. I think Juachi or Dra Wakiki should be close to leveling up. 3,000, almost pretty much 4,000 experience until he levels up. Can we do it by this episode? That's the real question. I want to know. Oh, I didn't mean to switch up Juachi. I, I thought I put Joldick up front. <laughs> well, that worked out just fine for us. <laughs> Sweet. I thought I put Joldick up front. What am I thinking? All right, there we go. So let's use Waterfall again. And let's go ahead and battle this guy. No, Tentacle. I'm tired of Tentacles. Alright, let's battle this guy. Battle me, Pooh! Don't have a freaking Tentacruel on your team. Alright, it's a Buizo. Nice. That's just what I needed for my Jolder. <laughs> Working in my favor. This game is looking pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, cool. So here comes a Float to level 40. All these Pokemon are just level 40 still. What the heck, man? Jolder is now level 52, though. Nice, nice. I don't know what's another Float to. Alright, cool. So how much experience is he is 
Uh, Waikiki gaining per Pokemon that we kill. Almost a thousand. So, three Pokemon, and then he'll probably level up. Three more, three more Pokemon to kill, and he'll probably level up. And we have ten minutes left. I think we could do it. Sub Falls Cave. We can definitely catch something in here. So let me write that down. Sub Falls Cave, and see what we can get. We have Joltik up front, right? So we can have Spore. All right, cool. Oh, wait, how many, how many balls do we have? Seven balls. I don't know if that's gonna be enough. We'll find out though. <laughs> Well, we, we'll just find out. Oh, I have rocks. I have rock climb on my blunt. That's good. And we got an old amber. It's a key item. Oh, this must be important. What is it? Still containing the genes of an ancient Pokemon. What? Is that like a fossil or something that we can? If that's a fossil, I'm down for that. For sure. show. <laughs> but anyway, our first encounter in uh, Sub Falls Cave is going to be a uh, dope bat. Get out of here. Screw out of you, don't bat. <laughs> so let's keep on going. Uh, are we outside? The waterfall gorge again. No, all right. Let's get a let's get an encounter. Subfall caves. Dang it! And not a freaking dope bat. Not dope bat. I said. Okay, not a zoo bat. Excuse me. <laughs> not anyway. Bayonet. All right, all right. I can do that. Uh, let's pour this guy. Oh, it has insomnia. Okay, let me go into Wakiki and go ahead and dragon rage this guy. Oh no. No, I hate curse. I hate curse. I hate curse. I hate curse. And he just killed himself. Are you serious? Well, we didn't need we didn't need, we don't need a we don't need a ghost type. <laughs> God dang it, that's so messed up. He just killed himself, man. Suicide is never the answer. <laughs> no, it's kidding. Right, anyway, oh palito. Palito. Oh he doesn't have uh <laughs> what doesn't he have? Right? What the heck is the what the heck is the Hail. Rain? He makes it rain. What's the ability? Damp? No. Wow, how could I forget? Drizzle. Drizzle. <laughs> how could I forget it? Wakiki's wow, level 55 though! Yes! Look at that, man. His, his attack is okay. <laughs> but his special attack is pretty good too. So we can actually run a special attacking Wakiki, which we do already. Wakiki's gonna evolve today, guys. Oh, shoot! Oh man, let's let's super speed do this. Get out of here, Polyrad. Let me see my Wakiki evolve today. And what is gonna go on? Wakiki. Epic moment. You already know why. You already know why. <laughs> Wakiki's evolving. All right. We got a Dragonite, man. I don't know how. This is actually really weird. Wing attack? But I want to learn... I want to learn fly, though. Alright, we don't... I kind of want to keep Dragon Rage. But, hey, maybe he can learn Dragon Claw now, though. With his claws. He's freaking Dragon Tails right there. That's what he looks like. Uh, let me see if he can learn Dragon Claw. Yep, he can. There we go. Dragon Rage is out. Wakiki is now officially evolved. This is the first time I ever used Dragonite on the team before. Just letting you guys know. What the heck is Lapis holding? Oops. Item give. First time I ever used a Dragonite on my team is right now. God dang it. Alright, screw putting the experience here on. Yep, and we have it right here. That's about it, folks. <laughs> Oh, or you gotta battle some fools. Snorlax? Oh, heck no. More like Sporlax. <laughs> nah. Okay, let me go ahead and... Oh, shoot. This guy is bulky as heck. Slash you to death. Ah! Alright, cool. He's out. So let me, let me check a map, actually. And see where we are. Waterfall Gorge. We can keep going to the right. Or we can go up to the Path of Victory. How original. Such an original name. We're going to go figure out that, figure all that stuff out next time. I'm going to end off the video a little bit, uh, a little bit, uh, earlier than to, than uh, I usually do. Because we got Waikiki, a freaking Dragonite, man. All our Pokemon are fully evolved. We got a full team now, man. That is sick. <laughs> but anyway, so next time we're going to go try battling more trainers and try making us a path of victory next time. 
So look forward to that. But anyway, that'll be for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to peck up that like button down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So thank you guys for watching once again. I'll see you over in the next episode. But until then, stay safe. So burn it down, down.